All right, this is method number two. Uh, this is using a belt drive with a pulley. And again, I'm just using a model railroad transformer. This pulley has a uh, 1.49 millimeter bore. I've got about 90 of these in aluminum and about 140 of them in brass. And they use a very small 256 set screw. And you simply slide it on the shaft and tighten this down with just a tiny amount of torque. You don't need a lot. If you want it to be permanent, I'd use a little Loctite. But anyway, this is method number two. I'll put the belt up on this counter shaft or jack shaft. And we'll put a little voltage to it. And again, uh, I sell the motors by themselves. I sell the aluminum bracket and the pulleys. Uh, I also have a couple hundred of these O-rings, or actually they're drive belts. Um, but yeah, this is method number two. This is uh, direct drive, and then you've got maybe a 10 to 1 reduction. So up here, there's quite a bit of power. Uh, if you were to fix that to the axle with the set screw, Right now it's just running free on there. Anyway, thank you for watching.